The Upper Salmon River of Central Ontario is a popular whitewater route for spring runs, but is seldom travelled for canoe tripping purposes later in the summer. This trip served as an introduction to whitewater for the ladies, who displayed a marked improvement in strokes and confidence over the duration of the trip. We only ran class 1-2 to two sets and lined or portaged the rest. All sets were completed after careful scouting, river reading, and instructions regarding strokes, communication, and safety. Skilled paddlers in whitewater boats can run some of the larger sets, but for those lacking experience or equipment, portages skirt the obstacles, though these can become quite rough. So Nick, tell me what's going on right here. Well, we came up to the portage marker and uh, came up to a very large rapid, uh, probably class three. And uh, portage trail seemed to be good up until a certain point and then we ended up bushwhacking. So we got some, uh, some damage done. Lots of cuts and lots of bugs. Was it worth it? Yes. Caution should be exercised not just when running rivers and rapids, but while filming around them, especially with non-waterproof cameras. A sudden gust of wind can topple even the most sturdy of tripods and bring your filming to a soggy halt. The other camera may have been done in, but thankfully we also had a waterproof camera to capture the whitewater experience. A single dunking incident occurred that was unrelated to whitewater maneuvering, when a boat capsized just upstream of a small set. This presented an opportunity to practice rapid swimming and basic rescue technique. By the All other sets were run or avoided without further incidents. 